Hey chat, how's it going? Welcome to today's stream. Uh, before we get started properly, I've got to go and get my uh, cup of tea. I was running a little bit late. So I uh, just wanted to say I'm here. We'll be getting started very soon. Um, but I'm going to go away again. So sit tight. We're going to get started. There's lots of exciting stuff to do today. Um, all right, back in a minute. Hey chat, I'm back. Thank you very much for your patience. I don't know how much over time I was, but I am very thankful. Let's do some hellos. I see lots of smug dance chat. Uh, I also see Disco, Gumby, some Toy Channel 2. Welcome to the stream, some Toy Channel 2. Movies XP, Curbs Workshop, Ali's Game World, and Chalupa, hey, hey Mercury Angel 23, hello times two, second try, all right, Whew. I realized I didn't have a few things ready before we started, so that was a bit of a rush, but I have my tea now, I'm ready to have some fun. Let's switch over to my desktop. Did you love the little uh, dance animation that Voxy put together? Yeah, I was feeling fancy, Mercury. I went full name. Um, we're gonna start with something special first, before we begin proper. So moments before the stream, Gumby got in touch. Gumby Time 2008, who makes some wonderful edits. Basically every single video Gumby puts out is a banger. Um, put out a video called Spaceman PNG Tuber critically analyzes a cat pretending to be a lawyer. I have not seen this yet. I promise not to, to check it out until the stream, so we're gonna live react to this. But I think in order for the full um, experience, I should probably... I should have my Vado Tube character on top, right? So I'll be reacting to me reacting to a video of a cat lawyer for the full experience. Let me load this up first. Can't see chat for a moment just while I load this. Chalupa says it's so good, Dom. Okay, I can't wait. Come on, Vado Tube. Oh, wait, you have to... 
Oh, I didn't save it last time. Ah, okay. Hang on a sec. I didn't realize you had to save the Vado tube things uh, separately. I'll do this as fast as possible. Eyes closed, mouth closed. Eyes closed, mouth open. And stationary. And bounce, was it? Yeah, that was it, I think. And then that one on too. Okay, so let's save it this time. And we'll save it into here. I won't have my other designs right now, but it's fine. Um, all right, so I'm here. That can be sent to the back. Let me get the video up. I'll turn off the music for a moment. Make sure I can see chat. All right, so we're gonna be, we're going multiple layers deep on this. Let's full screen it for the full effect. All right, Gumby, thank you. Here we go, everyone. Let me bump up the volume a tiny bit to make sure we can hear it. It's a minute and 59 seconds. Every, every layer of this gets better. So let's just break it down briefly. Already great. So he's been spotted. He's been found out. He's been found out. The eyes have come down <laughs> to look at himself in his own monitor. Look at me now. Immediately, he's realized they can see it. He had the feeling in his heart they can probably Who's see this it. over here? But that confirmed. Pale blue. He's gotten a response. This dude's coming in for a closer look. Then, there's the moment that cements it. That is the... <laughs> <laughs> that little sound. <laughs> that's the moment that his life flashed before his eyes. Sorry, guys. Can you hear me good? I can hear you. I think it's a filter. It's an air con 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 The little con nod. I've got my assistant here. She's trying to, but... So his assistant has been trying. Presumably it's been on there since before the call began. And they started <laughs> the call hoping that it would just dis disable, it would just turn off. I'm imagining that <laughs> the assistant is just like sweating, frantically clicking all sorts of things. Uh, it's not working. Uh, I'm prepared to go forward. The little... He's resigned himself oh, wait till to the end. fate as a cat. Oh no, the arm. We need to go forward with it. That's it. We're just going to have to do whatever this District Court of Texas live stream was about. Whatever serious matter was being established here. Going to do it as a cat. I'm not a cat. He's not a cat, though. Uh, he, I, can, I can see that. He does want to remind us all I that he's not a cat. I'm not a cat. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> Gumby. Fantastic work, as always. That patented Gumby animation style. You, you know it's Gumby when you see... When you see a little flat dom head flying around. Round of applause. Go subscribe to Gumby. Uh, yeah, I'll copy the channel page in. I am not subscribed to Gumby. So I'm going to do that. And then copy this over to you guys. All right. Thank you again, Gumby. Beautiful. Thumbnail, honestly, powerful. Imagine not being subbed to Gumby. Kind of cringe. Yeah. Pretty much. Hey, Mustard. Good to see you. All right. Let's close this down and let's get to business. So... Today, I did spend a little bit of time uh, noodling with some ideas, for potential um, new faces for today. So I have this new file here. Uh, let's just jump in and see. I can't even remember. Oh yeah, okay, so I showed this one on Discord. So I actually, part of the reason that I made this one was because I wanted to play around with animation. I'd not done animation yet in A-Sprite, and I wanted to get a chance to uh, give it a go off camera, 
to not make a complete fool of myself when I came to try and do it here. It looks like it's pretty straightforward. The thing that really surprised me is that you don't... Because uh, I've previously used um, things like Photoshop, which can do animation, but they're not really designed to it, especially not layer-based animation. Well, let me put the music back on. Um, especially not layer-based animation. But a sprite can handle it really, really well. So I've made a two-frame animation here, and um, I can cycle between these frames with the left and right arrow keys. So, <laughs> the blinking uh, water droplet on the left doesn't work. Um, I just, I just put that there to send in Discord. But I wanted, <laughs> I wanted an eye twitch version. I don't really know why. <laughs> But maybe we can just, like, uh, take this element and paste it in here. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's doing that thing again. A weird kind of like half selected thing. I mean, it's not going to matter because I'm not on the that layer anyway. There we go. So let's maybe just try rotating it a little bit. Will this work? Curves Workshop says, also try upscaling the sprite to make it more pixelized. Yeah, um, I think that's a good idea for when we export them. Um, I'll kind of go through, uh, Voxy mentioned it yesterday. I'll go through and I'll make all of these like upscaled so they look nice and sharp on the video. On the uh, like overlay here. Okay, let's see this then. That's okay, I guess. The fact that maybe just the sparkle should shift. Not sure. I guess this is different from Panic Dom, because uh, I saw Dallas was asking. I don't really know what this is yet. This was just a bit more of an experiment. But anyway, we got these. But then we've also got a few others that I was uh, playing around with. So let's see what these are. Three more layers here. I can't remember what they exactly are. Oh, yes! <laughs> we got MGS, Dom. <laughs> I forgot about this one. <laughs> um, so right now, none of them have the multiple frames to actually be used in Vado Tube. Mustard says, this is the I just spent three hours carefully fixing and optimizing node on only to find out it's n entirely broken. Referring to this one, which, yeah, it 100% is. That's this one for sure. Um, this, <laughs> this is the snake dom one. I kind of gave up on the sneaking suit, but I was pretty pleased with the face. Um, and then the last one... Oh, the last one was I was beginning to do, like, the workout gear. Um, I, I think it was Chalupa yesterday mentioned having, like, a uh, a tank top and a sweatband. And as soon as I started drawing the snake one, I was like, oh, we can just recolor these. So we'll maybe do that as well. Uh, but I didn't have the full palette. And I didn't want to guess and then end up having to change it. So... What I'll do first, if I can duplicate a layer to another... Oh, that just duplicates it here. Okay, so let's undo that. Do I need to select... Edit, copy. Will this let me copy to a new palette? Edit... Paste this new layer. There we go, fantastic. Okay, so let's call this properties workout.
Must have, yeah, I I agree. Must have says I find it very very funny that Dom keeps wearing his little spacesuit, but just like at putting cute costumes over the top. Mm -hmm. Oh, must have, did you see the Harrison? Did you see the Harrison one? So that's the that's the base. But then there's uh this panicked face. This is the like you're about to get you're about to get spotted by the guard face. And then that's the default one. So next time you come on stream, we'll be able to have you up here too. When you speak. <laughs> okay, let's turn base back on, let's turn workout back on, and let's color this. Yeah, there's every face reveal right here. Multiple faces reveals. Reveals is... I guess I could even turn on the... Uh, I Mouth, closed, eyes open, so we can make sure that we don't overlap too much of the face. Okay, so I'm gonna begin by... Oh, I don't have my tablet plugged in. I always forget something. Okay, it's connected. It is working right off the back. Beautiful. On my desk lamp. Uh, I think we're definitely going the pink. And let's turn off the base layer here. Okay, so. I want to keep that chunky outline on this, I think. So in case you didn't see yesterday's stream, first of all, you should go check it out um, to get all of the details. But in short, we learned about a piece of software called VedoTube that allows you to make a very straightforward, very easy, very simple uh, PNG tuber as they call it, um, which you can see in the bottom right of the stream right now. We made lots of very funny, simple templates. And the idea is for these to appear in certain, in select streams. Um, not every single one, but especially like the design agency ones. Look at this, this is real uh, 80s workout attire. Yeah, same. Mustard, I was talking about this uh, just recently actually, saying how like, it's so funny that the sort of face of the channel is something that is a derivative of something that is a derivative. Um, but yeah, this is definitely the default dom, the paper, the flat dom from episode 15. Whoa, this music is absolutely powerful. There we go. Make a blocky dom for Minecraft streams. That's a really good shout. I think, a weird guy, I think you suggested that yesterday and I really like the idea. We just have like a very Minecraft Steve-esque face, I guess. I don't like the fact that the the uh, outline goes so dramatically up here. Uh, there we go. How was everyone's day today? I really do feel like this week is flying. Can't believe it. I can't believe that it's already... Um, Thursday, right? Yeah. 
Actually, let me just really quickly look what this would look like without the stroke around the outside. See you, Mr. Thanks for stopping by. Cool, Dallas. I can't wait to check out the marble run. Okay, so that's on the layer behind. So let's just uh, fill that in. I don't think I've got pressure sensitivity on. I haven't. So my idea is that all of these will be able to um, exist as layerable things. So I'm trying to make every single design fit. Oh yeah, that's definitely better because then we'll be able to put the eyebrows on top. Hey, congrats, Mercury. It always feels good when you get stuff done. It might not be the most uh, exciting stuff ever, but it's very, very rewarding to get it done, especially when you feel very grown up. I think I prefer it without the border because it's going to now um, allow us to do some better stuff with the eyebrows. Um, so let's widen this out. Just a touch. Does this feel right? I think this feels right. <laughs> yeah, I think that's better. <laughs> so we'll put the eyebrows on top now. So let's drag this down to where it needs to go. Oh, yes. Fantastic. Okay, and then we'll do the, we'll do the tank top. Next. Why do I not have the blue here? That's weird. Looking very 80s. Yeah, that was my desire. In this instance. I really, really would like to do a Ring Fit stream. Um, I mentioned before I don't have it, but uh, my brother does, and I think I think he would be okay with me borrowing it. I'll have to check. So this would be my representation in that instance. Okay, let's switch on the layer. Let's see how this looks. Pretty good. Okay, we got some weirdness going on up here. And also, we do need to put the line in between the helmet and the body. Which I thought... I thought that was on base. Perhaps... Oh no, of course not. It's on Nodon, isn't it? Yeah. Alright. Get rid of the selection, we don't need that anymore. Make sure we're selected on the correct layer. We're also going to do some layer tidying in a minute. <laughs> some toy channel says, we fit trainer. Nah, fitness dom takes the cake. <laughs> if I take the cake, I will have to work off all the calories immediately afterwards though. Mmm, beautiful. Now the, uh, now this doesn't look so bad. Maybe I can push the tank top up a little bit into the other outline. Yeah. Okay, that feels, that feels mostly correct. Right up here.
Nintendo vlogs, yeah, definitely. Um, if it's not feeling fun, don't don't push it. If you ever do ever anything like that, it'll have to be because you're um, you know, feeling the feeling the need to do it. And if it ever feels like you're forcing it, then it's not worth it. Oh no, G develop crashed. Software crash is such a bad feeling. Oh, I guess I should have like a number. I don't really have a number associated with my character. You know, like a like a like a jersey style. Yeah, I, I literally have never had a number. Lots of people kind of have a number that they associate with, don't they? I've never... I mean, I guess I should be number one. Oh, wait. Maybe... <laughs> Use an L for winner. Maybe I should be zero. Because then it will look like... Um, the O on the person node on. Right? That makes sense, doesn't it? Hashtag, like, hash zero? <laughs> Hang on, let's see. By the way, shout outs to BricksMat85 for putting together a really nice uh, compilation of obscure Nintendo tracks again. Zero feels right to me. I, also, the idea of it being like hash, like a marathon thing is also quite funny. It doesn't fit as well. So maybe we'll just do a zero. But I also want it to be a little bit oval, rather than a circle. So it's distinct from the other design. Yeah, something like this. Wait, what, um, what number was on t uh, Tall Guy or Long Guy or whatever um, Long Mousy's name was in, in your visual novel, Mercury? Absolute zero. Oh, Elite, that's, that is, that is a cool reference. Do 127, because that's Mustard's first log in DSA. That's how long he was on the planet. Ah, also very cool. Mercury Angel says it was 07, because flipped, it looks like L-O for Long Mousy. Cool, that is, that is neat. Okay, I think the workout look is done. Hmm, okay, let me just try one thing, though. No, I think the placement was good. I think the placement was good. Do I want a little bit of hair poking out there? It might get in the way of the might get in the way of the eyebrow. When do we get to see Dom without a Mungus costume? <laughs> uh, I don't know. 
That would be like... That would be like a face reveal of a, of a non-existent character. Although, I guess it would really be a rest of the head reveal. Also, I suppose I do need to do the sweat. This is kind of just me, Dom, though, right? Yeah, yeah, this is like a... This is a intentionally simplified version of my character. Let's try and do some little simple sweat drops here. But do I want to... Kind of go... <laughs> yeah, something like this. <laughs> Don't you hate it when sweat goes in your eye? That's that that's rough. It's a bad feeling. It stings. Come on. There we go. A bit more like it. Voxy mentioned um, swap note, flip note, whichever one it is, uh, yesterday, and I can't get it out of my mind how how flip note it looks. Looks weird for them to be here as well, I suppose. Can Vader choose recognize emotions? No, uh, so Yosh, it's only using my microphone. It doesn't use a camera. There are plenty of other um, sort of PNG tuber apps out there that you can do that with. Far more advanced, but I would rather not use my camera if I can avoid it. Disco says, after the last stream where you streamed Takeshi's Castle, I thought this episode was going to be you streaming episodes of How It's Made. Man, I do love How It's Made. I feel like that one is more likely to get me in trouble though it's still it's still on tv here hang on i can make a fake how it's made though uh factory block footage Okay, real quick, I'm gonna do- we're gonna take a, a little break for a second. Alright, let me get all the, the components in place here that we'll need. YouTube music library. Uh, what we're going to look for? We're going to look for technology. Let's see what that gives us. There's one here called How It's Supposed to Feel. It feels perfect. Sounds like how it's made. Let's give this a try. Ooh, loud. Apologies. No, 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 no. <laughs> Okay, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> okay, this this will work. Today, we're heading inside of a car manufacturing plant. From five o'clock, the factory 
is whirring away. But this factory doesn't just make cars. In fact, it makes DOM. Every year, this plant makes 25,000 DOMs per minute. <laughs> if you do the maths, that's more than 50 million DOMs per annum. This factory is in fact one of the largest polluters in the world. The reason for this is the high level of manufacturing that goes into the construction of each and every DOM. First, the raw aluminium is taken and ground down over and over again. This is to ensure the highest level of polish in every single piece. Once it's been ground down, it is in fact discarded, as aluminium is not required in the production of DOM. Beside the main plant is an electrical grid. This electrical grid is used to power the phones of all of the workers who work at the plant. Next to the car park is the bacon smoking facility. At 7 a.m., 55,000 bacon rashes are smoked in the on-site smoking facility. Here you can see a highly magnified photo of the end of a pencil. This pencil is used to mark the cardboard boxes manufactured here at the DOM making facility. Again, we see the highly magnified end of a mechanical pencil and the miniature, the miniature worker that works on the pencil. As night falls, the plant continues to churn out DOMs. All right, there's too much aerial footage here to work with. Okay, one last, one last segment. Let's see what we got. At the end of one year of production, the factory is abandoned. This is due to the highly radioactive waste produced in the manufacturing process. To mourn the fallen workers who are irradiated by this progress, t-shirts with the names of the, <laughs> the names of the fallen workers are produced and sent to the families. This has been how it's made. Thanks, YouTube. All right. Thanks, YouTube audio library. Let's go back to the game music. Um, so I think, I think we'll have to draw a separate face for these, but I don't really want to do it right now. I want to finish processing uh, the other basic ones that I drew and I polished them up. <laughs> Such as this one. <laughs> but I'm happy with the start of this. Oh, I did promise that I'd tidy up the layers. Let's get the layers uh, in some semblance of order. Close the Harrison folder. Body outline shadow. I guess all of these want to come down now. Hey, Bari, welcome. And they'll, they should really go into a folder called like costumes or something. So then we'll have uh, uh, reactions. We'll move the Harrison folder. I mean, really that needs to be copying into its own, own file at some point, I guess. Um, but we'll make a new group here called costumes and we'll drop all these other ones in I feel like I recognize this track what's this from I definitely recognize that bow
Let's see which ones of these can be layered together. Oh wait, our workout's not in the folder yet, that's what's happening. I guess not really many of them can be can be layered. <laughs> it's okay. Um, so we've got those in a folder together. Also, I I kept meaning to do it last time, but let's let's have that um, rhythm heaven space dance track. Oh, yeah. What a tune. All right, let's make a folder for these faces. New group. Um, reactions. Or I guess it should just be called faces, really. mouth closed together and the eyes open up here nice okay that feels good to be organized let's save this file and just have the note on outfit on for now and we're gonna copy across this one it's actually in two distinct parts at the moment I guess Oh no, it's all on that one. All right. So we copy and paste special. Hmm. Ooh, what happened here? Ah, I'm on the wrong layer or on the wrong uh, frame, excuse me. So, put it there. Don't like what's happening with the face right now. Not one bit. That face ain't right. There we go. We'll call this MGS. I kind of need a reference image. I was trying to remember roughly what it looked like. Hang on. MGS1 snake. There we go. There's that good high quality image. So yeah, I tried my best to capture the, um, the you know, the no eyes look. Um... Which I think I did okay. We can maybe do some dithering here. And the suit, less successful. I kind of got the general gist of things. It's basically like weird suit muscles. I don't think we'll get to see the belt. It's a bit too low, so we've got to focus up here. We don't have any arms, but we do have these sections here, I suppose. So let's have a play. Let's see what we can do. Guess I want to bring these wider. But it was quite nice having them quite angular. The muscles get printed on at the factory. They definitely, definitely do.
Turns out Snake's just a flabby mess under there. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get rid of the details around here for now. We'll, we'll do these back. We'll print these back on. Let's disconnect that, I suppose I can just fill. Okay, good start. Although, it kind of looks like a tank top again. Yeah, he's, he's holding his breath and sucking in the whole time. <laughs> as soon as he got in that submarine. Because <sighs> really, they have big shoulders. The suit has big shoulders. But is it going to look weird to break out of this frame? Is it just going to look more like my arms are missing? I guess if there were more like shoulder pads? Yeah, okay, I think that's that's kind of good. And then I can draw on a line here, maybe? Hmm. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. This is looking a bit more like it. Because it's got that high collar, hasn't it? Looking a bit greaser again. Unintentionally. Got a bit of a, you know, a biker gang look. Hey, what can I say? I've just got... Just got chewed. I need the reference image one more time. I suppose if I square that off... It could be a villain outfit or wizard attire. Hey Abe, thank you very much. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> okay, I think once we put put the chest details on, this will look more like what it's supposed to. Whoops. Missed my tab. Right, so we need we might need to reintroduce just a little bit of the pale blue there. Um, we need the pecs. Hey, Oxyol! So, down. What's watching this in school? Alright. I won't tell the teacher. Have I changed the way you talk to make the mouth open and close more accurately? Um, like IRL? And my mannerisms? Or mechanically? Hey Cookie Bird, thank you. 
I haven't done anything in Vado Tube. I think maybe just by the end of the stream we'd kind of nailed it. Yeah, we just had a How It's Made segment, so this is educational, if your teacher asks. So you learn all about the highly radioactive process of m mass producing millions of DOMs every year. I think I'm potentially over overcomplicating this design. I just want to get every element in. It's a very complex suit. Yeah, it animates really nice. I agree. The reason I want to include these is dumb, even, because I just... There's a detail on that suit that I always really liked, which is like three little dots on the shoulders. But I don't think we're going to need these. Hey, Arch. Good to see you. We're back in Vado Tube. We're back in Ace Sprite. Currently making an MGS suit, as you can probably tell. Just finished a ring fit suit. So we need the central line. It's really looking very, very greaser. Bring back the shoulder dots. Honestly, I'm I'm with you on that fight. They're so, the, the like, pecs on the suit are so angular. I feel like I've basically ended up with the same design I had before. Thicken up these lines a little bit. Painter aim for an idea. Let's do that next, Arch. Yeah, thank you for reminding me. I would very much like to have that for sure. We're going to do that next. Maybe I can even have a funny little beret. Can I maybe just do the shoulder dots in pale blue? How's this gonna look? That's okay, I guess. That's approximate enough, I think. What is this track? Oh, it's from Chibi Robo Photo Finder. I have not played Photo Finder. Okay, I think I'm basically happy with this one. Except for the face, which, as much as I like, I do want to just experiment a little bit with some dithering. Maybe get the, like, pink strip. Um, 
that we saw in a couple of Vo uh, Voxy designs. Meant to be like frown frown lines, but I think the placement's a little bit wrong. That makes more sense, doesn't it? Oh no, I dragged everything. Dom, it's called Let's Go Photo in the UK. I didn't know that. That's cool. I always find it fascinating when there's little changes to uh, games' names regionally. All right, so technically we should have the face on a different layer, just like the others. Let's cut this and paste it into faces and call this just snake for now. So I'm going to leave the face exactly as it is, but on the costume, I'm going to go in and uh, just try a couple of ideas out. So one would be to have just like a bit of this in the red, but it looks, I don't know whether it's gonna kind of convey the wrong emotions though. <laughs> I don't know what this is. <laughs> So then the other thing to try would be to use maybe the light blue along with um, gradient. See how this looks. That's working. I could probably even do that with the dark blue instead. Do you know what I was thinking about the other day that I was thinking I'd really like to play on stream sometime? I was thinking about Ape Escape 2. I love the Ape Escape series, but 2 I think might be my favorite. It's been a long time since I played it. Um, I think that would be a really fun one to play through. Yeah, that's working, isn't it? See the reference image again? Let's get a good look at Snake's face. Uh-huh. Oh yeah. And I guess now this will actually work with multiple faces. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. Nice, that'll do for our MGS suit. I, I'm not 100% happy with it, but... Um... It's fine for now. Maybe it ends up just needing like some buff arms too. Why is there a layer called Node on? Uh, because it is the the circle on the chest like the person mode on
can see it on my design here as well. Okay, so we're gonna do an art one, which is a great idea. Thank you, Arch, for reminding me. Get rid of this reference image. Gonna go to faces, new layer. Hey, not faces, we don't want faces. Delete that. Just leave. Default on. Yeah, the Ario paint design. Okay, so. Let us begin. I think I would have it white. Oh, I've still got, um... How would it look? Something like this. And they come out, don't they? And round. Kind of a little bit on the wrong side right now. I'm facing more to the right of frame. It's like a diaper. <laughs> Do I need to go... Yeah, maybe like this. And then... Kind of looking like a chef's apron right now. Ooh, uh... Yes, it was Disco, well spotted. I don't actually know that. What system was that for? Also need a pocket on the front. This isn't an apron, it's a bib. <laughs> let's let's see a reference image. Yeah, I guess the only issue is it's too short right now, right? Hang on, where's this? I tried to search our aprons and all it's doing is bringing up me bringing me up uh, places I can buy aprons. Yeah, the only problem is it's too too low. It needs to come right up here. <laughs> it is very biv like right now. And extend a little bit beyond the straps. Okay. I'm sorry, Disco. I added it this time. I, I, I find putting the wrong tags on the videos very funny. Uh, and although YouTube has a great track record of putting bad and funny uh, listings, that was me. That was me. That one was me. Going over the edge didn't really work here. <laughs> I 
All right, be honest, chat. Does this look anything like an apron? I think the fact that I've rounded these off might look, might be part of what looks weird. They need to just be more straight. Just put some paint splotches on it. Yeah, that will fix a lot, won't it? Maybe it should be yellow. Maybe the fact that it's blue, or not blue, like white is... I mean, that looks fantastic. That looks magnificent. That one looks like I'm about to bake something. I think the yellow looks really good. Get a load of this. Disco, Mr. Domino, even if Mr. Domino was just a soundtrack, it would be phenomenal. Uh, it, it rocks. The big high pocket on the apron will really help the look, I think. I want to check something. Have I been... Hmm, yeah, I have been kind of highlighting the edges, haven't I? That'll be like I'm doing a, a barbecue, though. This is my art gear. It's been a very long time. It's been a very long time since I played at Arch, but I don't ever remember being very good at it. Or I guess I should say I remember it being very difficult. This is messy. This is not great so far. Hey, Chalupa. Stream's going good. Uh, looks like overalls now. Yeah, I suppose I shouldn't have separated the two bits, but the outline is good. The outline helps. Overalls for a farming sim stream. I've never played one of the farming sim games, you know. I'm a big fan of sim games, but I never... I've never really... been drawn to farming sim. I'm always drawn to the trucking sim. I I have no interest in cars at all. Cars or trucks or anything like that. But Truck Simulator does seem like it would be quite quite enjoyable. There's a game that I really do like called uh Well, it's either called Spin Tires or Mud Runner. Um they're basically the same game, but they changed publishers, I guess. Um and it's the most grueling simulator I've ever come across. Where you're just like trudging through sludgy mud in a big, big old sort of uh, diesel truck. 
Um, and I love it. Actually, me and Harrison play it, or ha did play it quite a lot. We got really into it because it has co-op as well. And it's basically just me constantly rolling my truck over and Harrison having to uh, recover my truck. Uh, but it's immensely fun. Disco, you play Mudrunner! Amazing! Yeah, it it slaps. Um, it's, it is the most, it's probably the first time I've been like, oh no, I'm, I like a dad game. <laughs> it is an extremely dad game. Truck a hat and jacket for trucking simulator stream. <laughs> I'd need like a Ushanka or whatever those hats are called for that stream. For the cold weather. I feel like I got so hung up on the pocket of um, J.K. Persimmons as well. I don't know why I struggle so much with them. Which games is a dead game? Uh, we were talking about uh, Mud Runner. Wait. Wait, 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 what do we need one of, Chalupa? Sorry, I think I missed something. Mmm, yeah! Yeah, Disco. De I can imagine Death Stranding is also um, very relaxing. In parts, you know, when it's not the comics. Oh, a PNG tuber for your Animal Crossing New Horizons villager. Yes, good idea, good idea. Sorry, I read that as village. When you first posted that, I was like, for your village? I was like, hmm? Do the paint, paint splotches. This is paint. This isn't even strawberry jam. No, definitely not that. It looks even more like a bib now. This looks like my lunch. Beautiful. Whenever I'm painting with an apron on, my my apron always looks, instead of looking like this, it always, always looks like just hand streaks, where I've gotten paint on my hands and I've just like streaked it onto my, onto my apron. It's never this. Beautiful, uh, collage of paints. I 
I wonder how I'm going to be able to do a... I really want to do a berry. Also, I guess I need a paintbrush. Maybe I can hold it like a me. Just put a hand holding the on the holding onto the paintbrush. Mario Paint baby face. Oh, that should be an option. Of, yes. <laughs> so one thing we haven't investigated yet is the fact that you can import gifts into Vado Tube. Um, whoa. Wow, my computer was freaking out there for a second. Sorry if the stream lags. Er, lags. Um, and I was thinking a funny, a really funny GIF to use would be to um, have a GIF that looks static for a very long time and then animates. So if there's like a long period of silence or something, it would flick to a different face briefly. Red Mario Artist Berry, yeah. Yeah, it's gotta be, hasn't it? Really? And I can use the dark purple that we used on Mustard as the outline. So Mario doesn't actually wear um, a beret on Mario Paint though, it's just his hat backwards. But I would like to do a beret, if I can. I've got a little bit limited space here, honestly. Mmm, long silence equals drinking water. Give yourself more space to work with. I, I'm worried about what that will do with the uh, other... Oh, right, because it changes the canvas, doesn't it? Not the layer, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Good shout, everyone. Yeah, I think I know how to draw a berry. Oh, just like that. Right, for some reason I thought it was only going to change the size of the layer and then I thought it was going to mess up the layering, but of course not. Can't forget the little stalk. Alright, my friend wrote Sprite, help me out here. <laughs> Dom's little brother Dim is a talented finger painter. <laughs> I can believe it. There we go. Chalupa, I'm so, so glad to hear that. Chalupa says, these are some of uh, my fave streams now. Perfect to take walks to. Nice. Woo! Okay. Now a tiny bit. Let's fix the bits that get a little bit funky when you uh, wrote Sprite. Okay, and then let's do the outline. Yeah, it's very limited um, arch, but I like it. I think it is enough for us to do most everything we need. And it will give a nice sense of cohesion through the the different 
reactions or different uh, outfits. I'm so pleased about these um, compilations, by the way. This channel did a really great job with these. They're exactly, for the most part, exactly the vibe that I like for these streams. And they're long. There's no ads in the middle. Glorious. I see some Pikmin Bloom talk. I, uh... I've kept it on my phone for a lot longer than I thought I would. I think the main thing that's, um... Should this be... Should this be dark blue, though? Hmm... Yeah, I think it should. Um... The main thing that's kept me with it for longer than I anticipated is the fact that you don't need to open it. Like, you can just leave it on and walk with it. If it was like Pikmin or Pokemon Go and I was having to check it, I would probably have... probably have uh, gotten bored of it already. Yeah, blue outline looks good. Do you know who this is reminding me of? I don't think she ever wears... Um, I don't think she ever wears this outfit, but it reminds me of Nikki from Swap Note for some reason. Oh man, don't Google image search Nikki from Swap Note. Why do you have to be like this, internet? I guess it's just the, the simple shapes. Also... Look at this that I just spotted on my uh, Mario Paint Baby search. Oh, it won't show me big. Okay, I'll show it here. Look at this. This is incredible. I want a... <laughs> I want the Mario Paint Baby uh, pillow. <laughs> seat cushion what is this this is kind of cool oh it's from kitty Kirk's uprising i played a tiny bit of that my brother had it but i never had it um i know people really like kitty Icarus uprising Okay, that is done. I think we're going to need a bit more to the right so I can get this paintbrush in here. Uprising slaps. Glad to hear. That was one of those weird ones. Wasn't that ex like pretty exclusively why the circle pad uh, uh, accessory was made before the new 3DS came out? Hey W, welcome to the stream. Oh, you know what I should do to, to be even more of a Mario Paint reference? Um, Mario Paint has... He has the yellow splodge on his hat. And I can't put yellow on the apron because it's already yellow. So we'll do it up here.
These need to look way more paint splodgy than they do. Oh yeah, there's lots of strawberry jam on the hat. You just can't see it. Wow, Gumby's already finished the How It's Made video and posted it on Discord. Are we going to have to take another little video break? I think we might. Hang on, I think these are too close together right now. Gumby not only creates incredible edits, but somehow manages to do it super fast. I am the slowest editor in the world. Um, and Gumby is the fastest I've ever met. Why does that feel so weird? Okay, let's just leave it for now. We're going to take a little break. Watch this. Watch this edit. Reacting again. I will. Oh my goodness. Maybe that's what I was thinking of Elite. So Elite just posted uh, Dolo, who I do not remember at all, who was from Swap Doodle. Wait, what is Swap Doodle? Is Swap Doodle the fan one? Super, super small here, but you get the idea. Maybe that's why I don't recognize Dolo. Uh. Okay. Ah, Gumby is an embedded uh, MOV. All right, I'll download it. It's fine. <laughs> Frizz might just wrote in off topic. I have a confession. I have no clue what Baby Town is. <laughs> All right, let's look at this video. It's going to be loud as soon as I open it, so I'm sorry. I'm going to have to stop it as fast as possible. Okay, real quick, I'm going to do... We're going to take a... That wasn't actually as loud as I thought it would be. Okay, real quick, I'm going to do... We're going to take a, a little break. I'll turn off my overlay. Do, 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 do. YouTube music library. Uh, what are we going to look for? We're going to look for technology. Let's see what that gives us. Oh, no, 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 no. Sorry. There's one here called How It's Supposed to Feel. It feels... Perfect. Sounds like how it's made. Let's give this a try. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, this this will work. <laughs> the zoom. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna talk over this just in case this content matches. <laughs> in fact, I will turn it down briefly and talk over this. I'm talking to hopefully present any, prevent any content match. What a great intro. What a great show. Today, we're heading inside of a car manufacturing plant. From five o'clock, the factory is whirring away. But this factory doesn't just make cars. In fact, it makes Dom. Every year, this plant makes 25,000 DOMs per minute. If you do the maths, that's more than 50 million DOMs per annum. This factory is in fact one of the largest polluters in the world. The reason for this is the high level of manufacturing that goes into the construction of each and every dom. First, the raw aluminium is taken and ground down over and over again. Hey Ginger. This is to ensure the highest level of polish in every single piece. Once it's been ground down, it is in fact discarded as aluminium is not required in the production of dom. Beside the main plant, is an electrical grid. This electrical grid is used to power the phones of all of the workers who work at the plant. 
Next to the car park <laughs> is the bacon smoking facility. At 7 a.m., 55,000 bacon rashes are smoked in the on-site smoking facility. Here you can see a highly magnified photo of the end of a pencil. This pencil is used to mark the cardboard boxes manufactured here at the DOM making facility. Again, we see the highly magnified end of a mechanical pencil and the miniature worker that works on the pencil. As night falls, the plant continues to churn out DOMs. All right, there's too much aerial footage here to work with. Okay, one last, one last segment. Let's see what we got. At the end of one year of production, the factory is abandoned. This is due to the highly radioactive waste produced in the manufacturing process. To mourn the fallen workers who are irradiated by this progress, t-shirts with the names of the, <laughs> the names of the fallen workers are produced and sent to the families. This has been How It's Made. Thanks, YouTube. Okay, real quick, I'm gonna do- Thanks, gonna Gumby. Break for a second. That has to be a record. We've never had, we've never had uh, a, a clip from a stream edited and shared whilst the stream is still going. <laughs> the, the crazy like kinetic zooms that Gumby does always cracks me up every single time. Thank you very much for sharing that. Back to this absolute insane jam session we've got here. <sighs> Paintbrush time. Should we go? Hmm. I guess it needs an outline, doesn't it? Oh, while I'm talking, we can have this, the paintbrush rotate as well. Sorry for scaring you, Ginger. The, uh, that segment was live earlier in the stream. I want there to definitely be paint on the end of the brush. And then I'm just gonna... It looks like I'm... cosplaying as the Statue of Liberty. Flat brush would probably be the easiest to draw. That's true! That is a good point, Mercury. Uh, we are currently jamming to the Niche and Obscure 2nd Edition playlist of Nintendo music by BricksMat85. We listened to part 1 yesterday. Um, and today we're listening to part 2. I'll drop a link, actually, in the chat. Is the stream chugging at all? My computer seems to be having a bad day today. Like, even just switching tabs is uh, causing it to freak out. You know what soundtrack absolutely rocks? The Police Nought soundtrack. During um, mine and uh, Mustard's playthrough of MGS1, we mentioned that we've been playing Police Nords. It's basically the only uh, pre Death Stranding Kojima game that I haven't I hadn't uh, played to completion. Um, and man, it, it rocks. I used to think that the Snatcher soundtrack was fantastic, uh, which it is, 
but the police noughts one absolutely blows it out of the water. Might have to listen to some of that in a bit. Yeah, I think I'm going to get really simple with the hand. Just a big old circle. Hey, Kiwi. Welcome to the stream. Should it intersect or bisect the paintbrush? Hmm, not sure yet. Oh, this is gonna rock. What's this? E-reader title screen music. Yes, please. Oh, I'm so, so into this. It feels a little bit like a Streets of Rage 2 track or something. I feel like any second now we're going to hear like a very, very crunchy, yeah, sound effect. My goodness, this is too good. Oh, crew. I've definitely played it before on uh, on stream, but it reminds me a lot of um, the Saturn Bomberman OST. Hey, Voxy! Welcome to the stream for a few minutes. Uh, we've been making a couple of different costumes. This is the paint one right now. Uh, what else do we have? We have... An MGS one. Uh, we have the snake face, and we have the workout outfit, <laughs> and we have. I'm missing something. What? What am I missing? Oh, uh, these here, which I haven't ported across yet. Low, low key version of this track. I like it. Why do we have two frames? We don't need any frames here. Get out of here. All right, let's put the Paint one back on. Yeah, the eye twitch turned out pretty good. I'm pleased with the eye twitch. <laughs> Look, at this. Look at this combo. The thing I'm most happiest about is how uh, interchangeable these elements are. <laughs> this is like when you're doing... This is like when you're in like uh, art class in primary school. And you've done, you've drawn the most ridiculous squiggle ever, and then you have to present it to the teacher as if it's some kind of artistic masterpiece. Oh, what did I change there? Oh, <laughs> all the other kids in class. You. Yeah, when you paint on the wrong layer, definitely.
Mmm, nice, 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 nice. Let's fix the thickness of this. I can't wait to do like the uh, the brush movement. Oh yeah, what should I do here? It's okay. Hmm. Oh, it's my paintbrush, I suppose, so... But that doesn't feel right. What if I fill it? Is that gonna look weird? Oh, yeah, it loses a bit of detail. <laughs> Don't eat the yellow paint, it's not cheese. Oh, But I've been dipping my Doritos in it. Uh, I don't know, chat. I need your I need your advice here. I don't know what to color this a little bit in. I know this literally doesn't matter, but I think the other thing I should maybe do is bearing in mind that this will be quite small. I guess I should make these a little bit more splodgy rather than little tiny dots. Let's try um, logifying this. Yeah, Voxy, we were just talking about it earlier, right? Um, I really like the very limited palette that we've got here, and I want to keep them as consistent as possible through all the different outfits. This one had to be bright, for sure. Yeah, same scale as the one on the berry. I agree, yeah. What is this from? Sorry, I, I feel like I'm constantly asking that this stream, but there's just so many good tracks. What I what even is this? Gift Pier? Nanashi FM Pop Error. Does anyone have any idea what that is? Because I love this. And <laughs> Dom streaming one-off games to justify <laughs> more Avatar costumes. <laughs> I don't need no justification. Although I really do... I... I've been... So... Yeah, there's a lot of games I really wanna... Really wanna stream. And I have been... I have been lax... On quite a few of them recently. So if this incentivizes me... That will be good. But I suppose in a way, these streams have just been on days that I wasn't going to really have time to plan a full stream anyway. So it's not like this instead of the other. This is like this on top of the other. But I do feel bad. There is a lot of things people are waiting for. Oh man, this guy. I want to check that out. I, I'm so drawn to games with good soundtracks, even if the gameplay isn't necessarily fantastic, I'm... From the sound, I couldn't even guess what system that would be on. 
sounded way too high fidelity to be a handheld, like a DS game or something. Maybe GameCube era? Nice. I think that's good. Oh, maybe we can close out today's stream with Dogsy because I was thinking about how how sadly neglected Dogsy has been, and it would only take me a little bit of time. We'll do a Dogsy. I mean, I did I did try and do Dogsy, but we ended up with Mutsy, which you know some may say was a blessing, others would say was a curse. All right, I think we're basically done. I don't think the paint should go over the stroke here. Dogsy always being forgotten is a good bit though. That's true. But I can't do that to our, our boy. Mutsy gives purpose to George. <laughs> wow, I don't know who I feel worse for. Mutsy or George from that statement. Something, something, the real Mutz, uh, Dogsy is the friends we made along the way. Ooh. Why did my tablet stop? There we go. I recognize this. Is this Animal Crossing? Oh, it's Mario Artist Talent Studio. That's why I recognize it. Same composer. <sighs> what a uh, what a musician. Sweet. I'm clapping in celebration for uh, completing this new costume. Art. Artist. What if you're feeling like a fancy artist? Why not put on the bow tie as well? What if you're feeling like uh doing a workout <laughs> what if you're doing like very intense kinetic painting you can do both oh actually one sec i've just seen a little bit i missed on the paint here beautiful Okay, I'm glad that we have the artist one done. Let's save this. Um, do we want to do... Do we want to do a Panic Dom face? I think that would be useful. I'm trying to think of things that we'd be able to use in, like, generic streams. So, like, Panic Dom maybe when it gets to a intense gameplay section. Cool Gamer Dom when I make it through the intense gaming section. We'll make a new layer in here. In fact, we won't do it like this. We'll copy a layer. <laughs> Family photo, but Dogsy's face is blocked by something in the foreground. <laughs> <laughs> People getting cut out of frame on photos or blocked by something is, is so funny to me. It's always so funny. 
Hmm, I wonder if you could do a thing like instead of storing outfits as emotes, you store them as separate Vado projects, that way they each have their own expression set. Wouldn't that mean running multiple instances of Vado tube? Oh, I did look... I did look at, um... Like, super cheap... I think I said this on the Discord. Super cheap numpads. Like, USB numpads. Um... Because... I, of course, was like... I've looked at Stream Decks. They seem very fun. They seem incredibly expensive and incredibly... Um... Overkill. Just ridiculous. But I did find a tutorial that was saying, like, hey, you can treat a, um, you can treat a USB numpad as a separate keyboard using a piece of software so it won't conflict with other key bindings. So I can, like, just map these different, um, uh, reactions and, and emotes or whatever to the keypad and I will print out some stickers to put on them so I'll have like quick access to them. I'm, I'm probably gonna do it. It was like 10 pounds. It feels like too too fun of an opportunity to pass up. I ran off the assumption that you wouldn't necessarily change outfits midstream. That all right I get you I get you yeah 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 that that makes a lot of sense. And use a controller that's a nice idea. What was I going to do? Oh, I was going to find a... I was going to find the Panic Dom emote. Do -do -do -do. Okay. Let's see chat again. Yeah, Voxy, the um the tutorial I looked at showed a little kind of piece of software that you run to um distinguish between USB devices. It looked pretty straightforward. Um it can treat one keyboard as a distinct device from another, which is cool. Okay, so we're deleting this layer because I changed my mind on how I was going to do this, and we're duplicating this one. It may have even been auto hotkey, I'm not sure. We're going to do a do uh, panic dom. Oh, that arpeggio there was really nice. Had some stereo separation too. Wait, where did my other eye go? Why did why did it disappear? Yeah, 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 Voxy, I, I, I understand what you mean now. That's definitely the way to do it. So I'll have to touch these up anyway, but this is a nice little draft idea. Okay, so my eyes need to be a bit more dot-like here, I think. Some toy channel is making or playing Wii Sports right now. Nice. Nice. 
I instantly knew this was going to be Kirby from that first little plinky piano sound. Okay, so let's do the mouth next. Do you see that one pixel mouth? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, honestly, the circular eyes are kind of nice. Just generally. Hmm. Hmm. Let's keep that in mind. Maybe we'll go back and change the, uh, other ones. It'll be as easy as uh, pasting them in. That's okay, but I've definitely d drawn it backwards, haven't I? Whoops, no. Flip horizontal. The eyebrows will have to go up a bit. I feel like I'm getting a slightly, ever so slightly faster with uh, a sprite now as well. Wrong template for the body. What do you mean, Voxy? I've got node on here. See you, Disco. Thanks very much for hanging out. It's just classed as an outfit, so maybe that's what you're thinking of. Unless did I completely miss something? Did we change the body at some point? Uh, it's a separate layer for now. Um, it doesn't need to be. It just is. It was since yesterday. Because I would never, I would never have it without this. So in fact, I may as well just crush this down into body now. There we go. Yeah, yeah, you're you're totally right, Voxy. It was just um I hadn't changed it. Sweet. Oh yeah, sure. Uh I think I just actually went through them, but I'll go through them one more time. So this is not the faces right now. I'll leave all the faces as default. Uh, so this is just outfits. We've got an MGS suit. Which, honestly, I'm not happy with. I don't think it really worked. But it's fine, we'll leave it. But the workout suit. Happy with. Very happy with. Although, I guess... These would probably have to be on a face layer the sweat would have to be on a face layer rather than be part of the outfit um but we'll change that later we still got that test um deep space adventure suit which needs um this filling now that this is all on one layer but it also needs much more work than that anyway got the suit love it 
We've got the tie-in badge which can go on the suit. But I've kept separate just in case. Uh, we've got the artist outfit. We've got the bow tie which is its own thing right now. Um, but it can be, be combined with other stuff like the suit. And then in the faces, we have the standards open and close ones. We've got the snake face. And we've got the panic face. We can just do uh, glasses as a separate layer, uh, Dallas, so they can be combined with anything. Interesting. So Voxy messed around with actual CGA colors. It's pretty fun to work with such harsh limitations, but the colors are brighter and not as contrasty. There's no orange, just a sort of coral red. Oh, it says, I think the artist costume is the best one. I, I really like the artist costume. <laughs> oh, wait, hang on. <laughs> There's so much going on there. <laughs> Suit, apron, tie, name tag. All right, let's do the sweat drops for the Panic Dom. I guess I'll do them off the head so I can work with um, the pale blue. Because in the emote, they're contained within the face. And again, we'll probably end up animating this. Uh, Lucian also seconds the request of glasses on a new layer. Okay, we'll do some glasses next. You know a game that I never really enjoyed, but the soundtrack just absolutely slapped? Um... Fantasy Star Online on the Dreamcast. Uh, such a good, such a good vibe, the music in that. I feel like it was the lobby music was my favorite. be rotated ever so slightly. Ugh. It does do a pretty okay job actually, doesn't it, Rote Sprite? It looks janky when you're actually mid-rotation, but it cleans up in the end. You know what other, what other uh what other thing we need we do need like nerd glasses we do need like the circle frame um chwinked out glasses oh this track kicks kicks butt kicks behind Honestly, I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna shrink the eyes down on all of them. They are better than the long eyes. I'm very excited for the new Kirby game. 
from Toy Channel. Oops. <laughs> Don't know how I switched to that with such ease. We need to copy those faces across. Kicks a butt is what I was going to say. <laughs> Harry Potter spectacles. I didn't know that you were a wizard, Dom. What do you mean, Hagrid? Those spectacles. They're for wizards. Oh. Okay. Wingardium Leviosa. Who is your new friend, Potter? Oh, Professor Snape! This is Dom, he's a very cool gamer! Dom, is it? Hmm... Welcome to the... Dark Arts class. I actually know nothing about Harry Potter. <laughs> so I can't really... Do, I can't really do a bit. I can kind of vaguely remember the, uh first film. That's about it. I think I did end up seeing all of them. Um, and I did read most of them as a kid, but I have not retained the information. <laughs> Harry Potter and the Optician's Appointment. I remember it was Stephen Fry that read the audiobook. That's okay. I think that's fine. Hmm. That'll do. I guess it should have a droplet... or uh, a specularity here, right? Is that how it works? This sound right here, that lead synth, is so nice. The gentle, like, reflections when it plays. Yeah, uh, JK Rowling sucks. Straight up. Um, so I guess if I had any interest in going back to Harry Potter, it has dampened that massively. Looks be be beveled, be beveled, who? Rather than spec, uh, rather than spherical, yeah. Hmm. Huh. Oh, maybe this is running along too much of it. says, I prefer J.K. Persimmons writing. <laughs> oh, we'll do Villager Dom, yeah. Lucien says, it is tough but necessary to separate the art from the artist sometimes. For sure, yeah. Um, I think generally I agree with that statement, yeah. Um, I guess it is also true, though, that it can dissuade you from from returning to things that you're, you may otherwise be interested to return to. J.K. Persimmons has books. They would all be about like the best time to plant crops and uh, 
the beauty of nature, I suppose, if he was going to get very... poetic about things. In this stream, I will spend several hours trying to work out how to highlight a sweat droplet. The Barbaros of Farmers. I, I imagine that J.K. Persimmons is far more excitable than Bob Ross. Bob Ross is always so chill. So you want to start a garden by J.K. Persimmons? <laughs> yes. That is... That is canon. Look, I'm leaving it there. It looks bad. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna continue on those. Uh, we're gonna do villager dom. We're gonna do an Animal Crossing version. Do I have a photo reference to hand for how my villager looks? I think I probably do have my switch. Let me see. Using my switch in handheld mode. I won't be able to bring it up on the stream, sadly, because of the way I've got the scene set up at the moment. There's a good picture of me sat next to... What's her face? Is it Eloise? Right, we'll use this one as our base again. Oh, I promised sunglasses first, didn't I? Okay, hang on, let's do sunglasses first. Oh, excuse me. Uh, new layer. We'll do sunglasses first. I'm so bad at drawing sunglasses. I'm so bad at drawing glasses, I'm gonna need a, a reference. I also didn't do Mario Paint baby face. Okay, we'll come back to that. Glasses, Mario Paint baby face, Animal Crossing, and then we'll close it out. I'm gonna Google image search cool sunglasses as requested by Dallas. They're gonna end up being like black gray bands, aren't they basically? Alright, got some. Put my switch away for a second. Okay, this is my sunglasses layer. Bum, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. I'm not gonna worry too much about the eyebrows now. Okay, this is an alright shape so far. Now I'm looking like Swap Note Nikki. I'm not going to do arms on them. I think it will just overcomplicate things. Maybe I can just mirror this. Oh, 
Oh, Ouija boys, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sure that's very uncomfortable. IRL Dom? I do not have glasses, no. Um, it's been a long time since I had my eyes checked. But I think mostly I am fortunate. Um, I'm going to have them at some point, I'm sure, because most of the rest of my family does. Seem like reading glasses. Yeah, maybe because they're a bit tight on this corner. I've been pulling a little bit less so they got that wideness of the sunglasses. Let's try copying this and flipping it. Oh no! Of course, yeah, the angle was gonna be all wrong. <laughs> Dumb, but nanny. <laughs> Oh yeah, in the, in the States, does nanny mean grandma, or does it mean, like, babysitter? Oh, I keep pressing Control F. I don't know why I'm using Control F. I, I tried to remember what that is on Photoshop recently. My finger just keeps automatically going there. Turn off the face for a second. Just means babysitter. Okay, so same same as here. Wait, 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 no. Any? I guess yeah, I guess it's mainly just babysitter here. Some people do say nanny for their grandma though. Necessarily all streams, Ouija boys. <laughs> Super nanny? I look like it looks like the um secretary from Monsters Inc. Because I've given them too much of like wings here, haven't I? Mike Wazowski. Just fill in the frames dark blue and you've got yourself sunglasses. Well... What if they were... Light blue with white? Gotta be some way to do this. Looking like a party cup from the 90s here. Hmm. Ah, uh, thick diagonal lines. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Good shout, Chalupa.
I know exactly what you mean. Like this, right? Although this is, I guess, what I'm going to basically do on the nerd glasses. Which, I don't mean that in a... No, casting no aspersions with that statement. It's just the best descriptor. Make them dark blue too with light reflections. Okay, I'll do both of these first and then we'll, we'll compare and contrast. We'll have an A and a B. Don't overdo the reflections. Copy that. Is that too much? Have I overdone the reflections? Too much? Is that preferable? This one here? Two is better. I like the right side. Two lines is good. Okay, cool. Thanks, folks. Sort of, but this is not far enough over. Oh, is that thickness a bit nicer? I think I had my YouTube thing in top chat. I normally have it in live chat because I think I was missing a few people's messages here. Let me let chat catch up. Make the right strip a bit thinner too. Far right one. Just I think this needs to come left a tiny bit, right? 
Like that? No, 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 sorry, my bad. Twitch sub, or a Twitch VOD, excuse me, of MGS2 just hit Lucy Vela's sub box. It is a really interesting game. I don't think we will do one, a run through on this channel. Um, but man, if you, were, if you enjoyed MGS1, you should check it out. Not the distance, yeah. But differentiate between the two, gotcha. Hey, .NET! I'm glad that you enjoyed it. Um, and never feel like you need to chat in chat if you just wanna lurk, that's always just as welcome. Brighter outer edge of the shades is a bit wonky. This bit here. And then if I just There we go. <laughs> this needs this needs to bump out like that too, right? Ouija Boys feels like the last track perfectly described video dojo. That's that feels right to me. I think we're basically here on these. Well, this is a hard, but I, I feel like we managed this. There is definitely a difference in this angle of reflection here. This one is more diagonal. This one is a little bit more up down and it's a little curved. And I think this angle works better. So I will maybe try and mirror this and then we'll call it done. Had squarer, maybe. I don't want to mess too much with the shape though. I'm worried I'll lose it. Although I might just be. Remember, like when I made a backup of Mousies just to make one very simple change, and I was just feeling a bit nervous. It could be a similar thing. So part of what's determining that angle, I guess, is this side as well. That feels good. This one here is a bit... Off, maybe? Yeah. I think, we, I think we've probably got it. You know what will tell us whether we've got it? If I do this. <laughs> hey. 
Yeah, that's definitely right. <laughs> Alright, let's do the nerd glasses. Oh, I clicked new frame because I was thinking about glasses, not new layer. Oh, finger guns! A finger guns layer would be very good. Hang on, I'm trying to keep mental track of the things that I promised, so it's like... Glasses, then it's Mario Paint Baby. I can't get sidetracked. Oh, this isn't terrifying. This isn't horrific at all. I don't have any paper, Lucian. I normally I normally have paper nearby, but I don't have any. And it's as you know, it's completely impossible to make make any kind of uh, note on a computer. I guess this should be pretty... Okay, that'll do. <laughs> it's a shame, it's weird that we got so f so developed with computers, but we never thought to implement any kind of way of taking a note on them. Like, interacting with them with keys or, you know, like imagine if you printed the alphabet onto the keys, that would be good, but... Nope. <laughs> I was trying to do, I was trying to do like, nerd glasses. Swimming goggles. Well, I haven't, I haven't finished yet, okay? Exactly like some kind of digital typewriter. Hmm. Yeah, we'll, we'll be doing shiny lines for the lenses. Oh, but these are meant to be like the shwing glasses, uh, Voxy. I mean, I can try just as frames, but it will be a very different... <laughs> if I do that, I'll have to be big. <laughs> oh 
Oh man, I'm freaking out. I'm panicking. Yeah, I was effectively trying to do Otacon glasses. This has got a little bit of an earthbound vibe to it, this music. Like a reorchestrated. Just fill them white. We can try. This was my original idea. I think honestly this is this is correct for these, right? Ooh, I forget what that instrument's called, that percussion instrument. But the one that's like whoop. I love that. Maybe they could be larger so the nose bridge is more balanced. They can definitely be larger if they're filled. It'll be very hard to do them larger without a fill, I think. Not a tambourine. It's the the sort of like sounds a bit like a little monkey sound. But it's used by pulling It's kind of like there's a a membrane, right? And you pull pull something that generates that sound. I have I have held one before. I forget what they're called and I forget what they how they exactly work. Is that, uh, Kuka? Lucian? Is that the pronunciation? Pushes air through a hole, I think. Yeah, I seem to remember that there's, like, a stick that you pull against a membrane. like welding goggles. I don't know, I've kind of lost it with these ones. don't really even know what these are meant to be anymore. Quika? Maybe.
All right, I think what I might do is I might go for a quick drink break. Feeling like a hot drink. Um, it's quite cold in this room today. So I might go and get a hot drink, which means I might be a couple of minutes longer than I normally am. Um, but what I'll do is I'll leave a poll up with like three options. One will be no fill. One will be... Uh, blue and white reflection which is this and one will just be white reflection which is just solid black kind of like last time oh is that the end of this playlist well find yeah, I might have some hot water. <laughs> uh, this is amusing me. Maybe I'm on board with this now. I went from being like, I don't know what I'm doing with this drawing. To weirdly being into it. Uh, yeah, I'll leave those polls up. I'll do whatever the majority say when I come back. Man, honestly, coming around on that. Coming around on that one. Um, right, so, poll first. In fact, music first. Fewer thoughts, heads, head emptier. Video game music. Classic. All right, I'll lift, leave this playlist on for now um, and do the poll. Okay, so option one. No fill. Option two. Blue fill. White reflection. Option three. Black, or not black, but dark blue. Or call it dark fill, just to be clear. Uh, blue reflection. Okay. I'm asking the community. And I am going for my water break. My drink break. Ooh, like I say, I will be... I will be a bit longer. Because I need to boil the kettle and stuff, so maybe closer to to three minutes, uh, perhaps four even. So use this time wisely, and I will see you in just a few. Hey, look, I I can stay here even with the drink break screen. Thank you. 
Hey, chat, I'm back. How is the poll going? Got myself... I ended up going for a tea in the end, but not like a, a black tea. Um, although I've made the mistake of bringing up the strainer, I just realized I don't really have anywhere to put it. I also got myself a banana. So let me just find somewhere to position this strainer. You know that saying, a watch pot never boils? It's definitely true of kettles. Felt like it was taking ages. I even was smart and I put very little water in there, just like exactly a cup's worth. Okay, so there's been 12 votes. Basically everybody in chat has voted. And the winner by a quite significant margin is blue filled with white reflections, which is what we have right now. So I'm gonna end this poll. Looking forward to this banana. I'm just reading back through chat. Wait, Mr. O says, I just made a dumb helmet, Mr. O, I had to. Wait, where is this? I'm just looking. <laughs> Okay, I just saw Disco's profile picture. I also saw the Gumby Dom, which is fantastic. Honestly, adorable. Um. Oh, and Squally made a handsome Squidward Dom. Hey, there's Mr. O's Dom. <laughs> Barely fits in the helmet due to my roundness. So nice. All right, I'll leave drink break up just for a minute when I, um... Well, I ate this banana. Banana break screen. Man, bananas are fantastic. I can kind of only half remember the story, but... Isn't there a story about how the foamy banana sweets taste the way that they do? Because they're really old, they're like Victorian era sweets. And those bananas went extinct because of a, a, some kind of banana eating virus. Or did we sort of breed them into oblivion or something? I can't remember. All right, almost finished with my banana. Don't forget to have a little stretch, reset your shoulders, especially. Give your neck a little little rotate too. Don't don't look directly back, right? That's not meant to be very good for you, but look down. Give it a, a slight tilt to the left and the right. Okay, banana consumed. Drink break screen. Going down. So basically this one, this one won. So maybe we just touch up the uh, reflections. Uh, I did see Foxy very kindly sent uh, some examples for the droplets on the sweat. So I think I will implement that in a moment, moment as well. Banana consumed. Banana consumed, but in the Dark Souls font.
All right, so let's tidy up these reflections a little bit. Because we scaled it, it's gone really blocky on the outside too. Whoa, Arch. Arch says, banana, mon banana monocultures are crazy. I think the current species of banana is under threat of extinction as well. That's really s scary. I don't know what I'd do without bananas. Oh, Gumby says, somebody tell me a past stream to edit. Chat, do you have any faves that you can recall that you would like to see get the Gumby edit treatment? Gumby says, what was that? Oh, I knocked the tea strainer uh, that I used in my cup over. That's probably what you heard. <laughs> yeah, I dropped the tea strainer onto my phone. <laughs> I actually got 90% of the way through a Christmas collab. The Christmas collab uh, highlight. Um... and haven't completed it, but it is, like, almost completely done. Mascot creator backstory readings. Yes, they're real. they would work perfectly. The little descriptions for each of the mascot creator, uh, appearances. The arch wrote, yeah, 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 yeah. They'd be perfect. Oh, I'm not using the graphics tablet. That's why it's not letting me do pressure sensitivity. Bag type, uh, pipe time. You know what? That's fine. Sure. I'll take it. Alright, let's just uh, round off the frames again since I scaled it. This is Pikmin 2, right? Pikmin? Oh, this one doesn't have the track listing. Fifteen minutes. Oh, there's like a wait, Donkey Kong. <laughs> oh, this is the Donkey Kong one. Yeah, it was Pikmin. absolutely adored Pikmin when it came out. The first one, man, absolutely blew, blew my mind. I think it was the first time I'd ever come across a game like that. Like the day and night cycle, like the limited playtime per day, um, per ga in game day. The management of the Pikmin and the order with which you could tackle things. It was so hard. I could barely wrap my brain around how to play it in terms of that side of stuff. Like the actual inputs and stuff were straightforward. The way you managed was actually remarkably straightforward, but just how much you had to 
keep track of in that first one. And then the boss fights themselves were really tough. Or they were for me anyway. Yeah, let's go with that. See you, Ouija boys. Thanks for hanging out as always. Oh, that tea's good. Uh, let's very quickly take a look at the sweat drops and try and apply the same kind of um, circular one. We're back to the sweat drops again. <laughs> I'm going to do this first try, it's going to be perfect. Oh, it feels like it should be more oval though. Why? I literally can't look at sweat drops anymore. Hey, scrubs. Good to see. All right. I think I will do... I think I will do... Mario Paint Baby Face. And then I will call it for today. Um, I'm surprisingly tired. I think this week has tired me out. I suppose I, I was up silly late last night, actually. I'd forgotten already. Uh, people were just absolutely going ham with the wonderful creations, and I kept, like, going, okay, I'm going to go to bed. And then um, somebody would post something else great, and I would have to go and check out what it was. So I have nobody but myself to blame. Could have just waited till the morning to see, but I was like a, like a kid on Christmas. Yeah, exactly, Mercury. It was very fun. Have Nintendo ever officially released a non-pixelated version of the baby face? Like, what it would look like if it was... You know, not 16 pixels wide or however big it is. I got FOMO, yeah. <laughs> Whoa! I think if I get one of these eyes right, then I can mirror them. The eye will be really important to sell this.
Okay, they need to be... They need to be set further apart, I think. AI upscale the baby sprite face. Baby face sprite. We need it enhanced. Yoshi's got an incredible singing voice. I think that's pretty much it. I do need to use red on the mouth part. Definitely don't force it, Voxy. You don't wanna you don't wanna overdo it. Doesn't Mario Maker have an upscaled baby face? Is that true? Is it upscaled? Mario Maker baby face. Mm. <laughs> Welcome someone. Is this a fan made thing or? Yes! This looks like it's real. Maybe make a uh, Mario Maker baby sound effect. Hmm. The only one I could find looked like it was a fan made thing. But it must have been upscaled for the... Okay, I do have it here, I believe. But you won't be able to see it on the stream, but I can see it as a reference. I think we basically got it. The only thing is that the mouth is a bit wider. Maybe the eyes are a bit flatter on top and the bottom. Okay, I can't just keep singing. The baby effect is first from Mario Paint.
Yeah, so the mouth is much wider in the Mario Maker version. Like this. Yeah, way more like that size. <laughs> Mr. O says, me. I'm gonna see what Dom's doing now. Sees this, I'm gonna head out. <laughs> Fair. Don't blame you. This has to be Animal Crossing music, right? But I don't recognize it. Oh, it's Breath of the Wild. Hey, Maverick. This is the Mario Paint baby face, yeah. At the end, can I turn on all the layers? That does sound like it would be very fun. All right, don't let me forget. God, it was like it was running towards me there. Cool. I think that's it. Let's call that baby. The mouth isn't perfect. By a long shot. But I think it's approximately. somehow much worse. Do it, Voxy. And then uh, next time we do do a games night, you'll uh, you'll be able to appear with it. I did see people talking about that in chat, and I, com I think I completely missed it yesterday. Oh, I really lost the shape. Okay, bear with me. Bear with me. I'm going to just quickly redo this, because I'm doing that thing where I'm finessing something that's not right. And I think if I just do it again, it'll be easy. So it curves up significantly more than in my previous attempt. Okay, much better. And then it just the semicircle sort of intersects with that stroke. Thank you. 
uh, which software that blue guy the one we're using to draw in is a sprite and the one that we're using as um, the PNG tuber software is called uh, what's it called Vado tube and there is a link to download that in the description Okay, that'll do. That'll do. That'll do, pig. I think that's probably going to do me for today. It's coming to 20 past 10 here. I'm going to try and be a little bit more on time to bed today. Um... But I feel like we've done a lot. I'm going to turn on all the layers and it will give us a sense of how much we've done here. Um, oh, and I suppose if you want to stick around, I might fix the eyes. I want to go more round eyes on the like standard layers. All right, let's do the all layers on thing. Already, already immensely cursed. Already powerfully... <laughs> So, good start. Good start. <laughs> when you're trying to work seven jobs at the same time. <laughs> Average TF2 player. Okay, let's go through and turn these off. Those ones on. This is really upsetting. Um... Yeah, 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 let me just do the rounding out of the eyes. So, not going to be much excitement here. It's literally going to be me copy and pasting this just before we finish the stream. If you want to hang out, that'd be lovely, but don't feel like you need to stick around. There won't be any more excitement. Yeah, I'm okay with those being the eye shape. What hatchy life. What a game. I never thought I would say this, but I miss me's <laughs> so much. I didn't dislike Mies or anything, but they, they just were such a staple, you kind of forgot they were there. And now I miss them. I feel like the Tic Tac eyes might just be too long. They're still a little bit elongated, Voxy. They're not perfectly circular. Maybe we need a middle ground. So instead of copying these ones, maybe I need to go in and just Shorten them the tiny bit. <laughs> now they're just M&Ms. <laughs> I... You know what? I reckon we'll see some Tomodachi stuff next year or this year yeah i think we're gonna see tomodachi stuff this year that's my prediction
That feels like a real sort of like put something out in November kind of game. Fantasy Life, was that the sort of Animal Crossing meets like a RPG thing, Mercury? I have a faint rec recognition of that. <laughs> when are we getting an m, m game where we can make our own m, &M Sona? <laughs> Uh, I mean, next, uh, next update for Mascot Creator? Just all m, &M variants. He says, it's funny how Dom can make really cute art, but simultaneously forget how glasses work. Yeah, I think that is the most accurate distillation of uh, how my brain works. The other great distillation of how my brain works was the other day where we were ending the Dojam stream and I was like, hey, I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the coin flip. And I said, one side is, you know, X wins, one side is Y wins. And I'd said it very clearly, and then by the time the coin had flipped through the air and landed on the back of my hand, I'd already forgotten. <laughs> These eyes are better. These eyes are much better. Alright, I'm gonna steal these eyes. Also, the 3DS was... Oh, I was drawing glasses and then I realized I've... Got on bits I shouldn't. The 3DS was a better home for me stuff, I think, than the... Wii was. I feel like the Wii U and 3DS era had better me stuff. Be gone. <laughs> well, that time you played the cool game with the soft serve buddy and you managed to do an impeccable corner jump, yet you couldn't see the, the giant open door right next to you. Yep. That also, that tracks. Yay! Okay, I'm pleased with this. Oh, hmm. I did want to... I did want to copy these across. I wanted to do this. <laughs> I mean, it's easy to copy them. I'll just, uh... grab stuff oh is it just like this there we go Are you going to make mustard with just as many expressions? I could, however, there wouldn't be any way to use them on stream. Oh, wait! I guess I could change the mic input. I guess I could change the mic input. If I had two instances of VadoTube running, I could change the mic input to be... 
uh, whichever input it is that I use for Discord, ux output. So then when, yeah, yeah, we could at least have the blinking animation and stuff. I was originally thinking of using reactive Discord images, but I could just have two instances of this open with a different save. Oh, what is this? Hmm, some community chaps. Yeah. I should. It's done that thing where... It's done that thing where I accidentally... got the select down here and I don't know how to fix it. minus the selection. Okay. Did I mess up by making this on a sec separate frame? grab something that is on a second frame I caught Wii music yes it is it's the no trophy for you track from I caught Wii okay so I've selected I'm on the layer that I want and I'm selecting that. Oh, there we go. Okay, I'd messed. I'd have clearly messed something up that last time. There we go. Thanks, Voxy. Yeah, I just saw your message. Perfect. Wait, I got the same one again. Um. Now it's not doing it. There we go. There we go. There we go. So I needed both the both the layer and the cell. Liked it, I guess. Oh, oh, right, 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 right. It's gonna, it's gonna keep it on its own cell. Is there no way to break this out into its own layer now, though? I guess I'll just have to activate this on each of these, but actually these should be continuous, shouldn't they? There we go. 
There we go. There we go. We got there. Uh, we got there eventually. <laughs> Selected on everything. Phew. Where's? Where's the onion skin? I have no idea how I've managed to mess this up so badly. Alright, get out of here you, and then let's start again. So we want both of these. What is, what are you? There we go, this will be the one. We got there in the end. So now there we go, we do have we do have both frames of that animation. Sweet. So let's call this eye twitch. We'll just twitch is fine. Nice. Okay. I think that's gonna do us. Thank you very, very much, everybody. I'm gonna save this file. This one can close now. We've grabbed everything off this. Um. <laughs> oh, that is such a good combo. That is such a good combo. <laughs> so, um, I just read Arch's message that says, Good night, Dom, you definitely didn't forget anything. And I realized, of course, I have forgotten that I said I'd do Dogsy. This is my face. Oh, this is my face remembering. <laughs> remembering that I'd forgotten to draw Dogsy. Boxy says, this is Andy Warhol. No, you know who it actually is? It's definitely David Hockney, isn't it? How's Hockney spelled? Just like that. That's exactly who this is. It's 100% David Hockney. And a good representative picture of David Hockney. That's an okay picture of David Hockney. No, look, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, no, I'm not forgetting dogs. Look, I'm going to do it right now. Everyone, everyone leave, it's fine. Everyone, everyone go. 
and I'll draw I'll draw Dogsy. Captain Toad, more like Captain Dogsy. <laughs> oh, your message actually scared me for a second. I was like... I don't have my webcam on. <laughs> Tom forgets about Dogsy like Nintendo forgets about F0, says Boxy. Maybe the reason I don't draw Dogsy is because I literally don't know how to draw Dogsy. What does even a dog look like? Has anyone even ever seen a dog? Is this what dogs look like? What does even a dog look like? <laughs> How does one even begin to draw a dog? question many have found themselves pondering. Many have posed the answer that in fact to draw the dog, one first has to draw themselves. You see, what is a dog, if not a reflection of the human condition? <laughs> Easy solution to drawing a dog, draw a cat instead. <laughs> circles here but I don't really have a color for it. I can probably cheat because this is not one of the DOM drawings so I can probably cheat a bit here, right? Oh, how could I ever forget the party hat? <laughs> that's not Dogsy, that's just a regular old dog. <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> Can you imagine you could only recognize Dogsy when Dogsy's wearing the party hat? Just walks into the room and you're like, what's this dog doing in the room? And then he 
pulls the party hat out of his pocket and you're like, Dogsy! <laughs> what are you doing here? Hey Chunky. Superman in reverse. That's a good point, yeah. Get out of here, you regular old dog. Kind of walks behind a lamppost and smoothly puts the party hat on. Dogsy! <laughs> Did you just see that dog? Dogsy's like... Urf. I'm gonna steal this... I'm gonna steal this, uh... Side of the mouth. Ooh, that's some deep lore, Voxy. Is that the hat that transforms the dog into Dogsy like Frosty the Snowman? I like the idea. I think it's more of just, uh, yeah, like a disguise, I guess. Uh, flip horizontal. There we go. Is Dogsy officially Mousy's pet dog? I, I don't like the idea of anyone having people as pets in the Baby Town universe because it's like the hamster in Animal Crossing. Where you're like, well, why, why is this, why is this hamster a pet <laughs> when, when there's a hamster right outside that's a villager? So I guess they have to be friends. Maybe they can live together, but. I don't think they can be- I don't think anyone can be anyone's pet. <laughs> Foxy says it's like monkeys and humans. Mm. What, as in like... No, I don't- I can't think of what that comparison could possibly mean. <laughs> this is Dogsy's theme. That's Dogsy singing. <laughs> Dogsy's so happily- happy to be finally acknowledged. Okay, this is this is verbatim what Voxy has just written. Like, you have dogs and you have dot 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 talking dogs, like Pluto and Goofy. Just like how you have monkeys and talking bald apes in the real world. It's different evolutionary branches. Hmm, I don't buy it. Strict no pets policy. Um, I already forgot what the layers were on the hat. What is it? Is it pink and... Pink and, uh... I know, I'll go to the wiki and check Mutsi's. Oh no, Mutsi's is the flame one.
<laughs> Dom is not open to the scientific method. The scientific method of Pluto and Goofy. Get out of here. You know, you know that Pluto sh shouldn't be. <laughs> you know Pluto shouldn't be treated different from the others. Free Pluto. Uh, I'm just going to freestyle this. If it's wrong, it's because Dogsy's wearing... Dogsy's wearing the spring 2022 look, which we've never be we've never seen before. I'm pretty sure there was green in here. We don't have yet. Oh, look at that mint... Oh, look at that mint green! Can today be Dogsy's canon birthday? Yes. What's the date today? 27th, is it? 27th of Jan? Also, I did see uh, a really nice comment. Arch said... Oh, did you remove it? Oh, I think Arch removed the comment. Never mind then. Oh no, there it is. Every dog has its day, and today is Dogsy's day. I like the thin stripes. Again, then we'll go back to pink here. Snazzy. Yeah, I like this. <laughs> Do I debate stream about the genus of Pluto? <laughs> Settle this in the marketplace of ideas. <laughs> I'd like to call forward my witness, Pluto. <gasps> should should this bit be white? Man, this is another good compilation. Oh, maybe. We. Has anyone ever seen that Navarro, uh, what is it called? Nirvana the Band the Show sketch where they sing lyrics to the, to the Wii Shopping Channel music. 
I remember the first time I came across it, um, it ch absolutely changed the way I think of this song forever. Mercury asks, does Babytown have any lawyers? Definitely, but you know who's not one of Babytown's lawyers? Phoenix Wrong. Definitely not. Easy to mistake. Good. All right, we need to give dogs the their little legs. He says the cursed baby town, lazy town mashup is stuck. Look in the head again. <laughs> Much like the time I got the uh, JK Persimmons uh, pun stuck in my head, you may need to address it. to draw I don't know how to draw animals from this perspective because <laughs> now it looks like he's <laughs> squatting down and there are his arms <laughs> like he's going in low says, I heard you were drawing Dogsy and dropped my homework and bolted over. <laughs> it's Dogsy's birthday. What is this? Pikmin? This is the last song in the playlist, it is. Okay, hang on. I need something else. Mm. Oh, yeah. Calm Nintendo music to finish the day. Peggy 18. I hope this Calm Nintendo music is not Peggy 18. Chalima says, so uh, what happened in between the birth of Dogsy and birth of Mutsy? <laughs> it's probably best we don't 
investigate that too too closely. I guess Doxy's body needs to be slightly longer. To make it not look like There we go, that might be working a bit better. <laughs> Quite good, I think. Hmm, yes. There we go. All you dogsy heads out there. Mutsi walks on two legs because he never skips leg day. <laughs> I do need to very quickly do one more thing though. Last thing for real. For real. Look. For realsies. We're gonna duplicate this layer. And I just want to show you the thing that I kept seeing as I was drawing this. <laughs> Perfect. In fact, we may need to... Uh. Uh. <laughs> what is that image? What is that image of the cat that's like leaning on the step and it looks like it's walking on two legs? Maybe that's what we're seeing here. This is an optical illusion. says, I'm gonna go walk my dog. <laughs> Doesn't look like he needs anyone to accompany him.
that's just writing delete. <laughs> Delete. <laughs> Oops. I have nothing to say. Oh, without a mouth is pretty powerful. <laughs> without a mouth is pretty powerful, but with a mouth will be immensely powerful. Yes. Mm-hmm. Correct. Mm-hmm. Go on. Intriguing. <laughs> I see. This must have been how the, um, this must have been how the designer of the moon emoji felt. <laughs> it's just everyone in the office telling them to stop. <laughs> Listen there, there's beautiful, relaxing music playing. <laughs> Easily the worst thing I've made. Wow. I've made some, I've made some heinous things in my time. I'm surprised that this wins. Yeah, we can maybe make, we can maybe pick some music that's a little bit more appropriate. Hang on. Give me a minute. I'll move this off the screen for a second so we're not, we don't have to stare at it. <laughs> yes, don't worry, Dogsy is, is safe. Safe and saved.
mood, dark, correct, genre, uh, classical. Right, what you got for us? Perfect. That was too short. That was too short. That was perfect. It was just too short. Doomsy. <laughs> Definitely the correct name. Doomsy is the name. Thank you for this suggestion, Arch. You can't blame me entirely, because look what Arch just said.
<laughs> Mercury says 50 people in chat screaming at each other in, in their suffering while Dom is laughing. <laughs> Excellent. See, look, Arch was... Arch was... ready for this. tracks over I guess we have to finish well good because we're done Mr. Rose says when Dom doesn't talk it means he's plotting nefarious things. <laughs>
Why chat? <laughs> What's what's all this in chat? What's going on? <laughs> all right, I'm going for reals. <laughs> See you, everyone. <laughs> Bye. Yeah, we're safe. See ya.